Okay, well, let's see if we can do the roll dice routine. Well, actually, before that, let's let's make a get input routine. So we need to roll a dice. So I'm just going to make the user enter that minute. Okay, and that'll be pretty much the same as what we've done before. Uh, is valid becomes false. while I hope you're getting used to this um, and notice what I'm doing when I'm typing uh, if I open something up I generally close it as well um, we input the number and we're checking if the number is in that range if number in one to six and do uh, this yep yeah, is valid it's true else So that's that's a basic get input one. So now we want to roll the dice. Okay, so we want to roll three dice. So we want to make a function roll dice, which is going to take, which is going to need to know the number of dice. Okay, we know the number of dice, then we can deal with whatever goes on. Okay, so what do we need to do inside here? So let's just try and work out roughly what we need to do. So we need to, for, for the number of dice, what do we need to do? We need to get an input, so let's call it score. And we need to get that input from get input because that's just a dice roll one to six and we need to work out if that's higher than the other one so we'll need to keep a track of the highest score so we can say highest and set that to zero to start with ask if score is greater than highest then highest becomes the score and if and then that will then do that however many times three get the input and work out the highest one and then we've got the highest one and then we add together the three high scores so we need three high scores don't we so let us Let's make this a list. Do we need a list? Uh, 